that attitude coach says it's infectious though you know in the team because when you do that want to run over a defendant defender it seems like everybody else wants to do the same thing as well oh uh, yeah no nah, i mean i guess it's contagious you know what i mean and, and i get i can i can be that point obviously you guys it's not like these guys are not physical i haven't been playing hard or running hard since before i got here you know what i mean it's just the fact that I don't know, I guess it, I mean, even if it was me on the other side to see somebody else do it, it'll turn me up and be like, I want to get some of that because I like the effect it brings. Mike actually has a name for it. He called it Wilsonitis. <laughs> yeah, man, I, I guess you can say that, though, you know what I mean? Uh, but that's just me, you know what I mean? That's how I play the game, and that's how I've always played the game. What's the kind of reaction you get on the sideline, you know, when you come back from a run, like, Put a euro step on somebody yeah. yesterday. Yeah. What's the kind of reaction you get from your teammates when you go back? You know, it, it be the it be the it be the pats and, and the good job, but it be the facial expressions that say more than words or any other thing. Just to come back and like to see those see the guys giving me that look, like like I feel you, brother. Like like keep giving it to me. I feel you. You turning me up. You know what I mean? And that's that's what gives me the thrill out of it to see them come back and be hyped and, and ready to you know what I mean play some NFL football. You've been Mike, with Mike McDaniels probably the longest now. Do you ever wonder what's going on in the mind of that dude? Because he's not the typical <laughs> coach. He never gives us the coach speech. We just never know what's going to come out of his mouth. Just, just talk about the, that, that mind of Mike. Man, he's, he's a mastermind. You know what I mean? He, he's, a, he's a guy that, that does a lot and has a lot on his plate now. So I, I can only imagine how much more is turning than what it was before, you know what I mean? Because he's always thinking, he's always working, he's always preparing, and he's always trying to be the, be the best, you know what I mean? So when you do that, it causes a, a lot of hours, you know what I mean? So i just I just thankful to his wife and family for, for being a great support to him. That way he can be at his best and, and give us all that, that he can. And he's doing a tremendous job. But trying to figure out what's exactly on his mind, I think that's impossible. <laughs>